Time now for my take. Yesterday I startled many and pleased tons of others by saying I believe the assault weapons in this country, the ban should be reinstated. That's because I believe the gun control issue is not simply black and white, but complicated. I said I was still in favor of the Second Amendment and even concealed carry. Still, I knew I'd get comments like these. At Gretchen Carlson's Winnie, well, I guess that's supposed to be whiny, ass, should leave the airwaves forever. Your anti-American comments today were among the stupidest I've ever heard. And I did not realize she was that stupid. And of course, there were a lot worse ones with tons of F-bombs and worse than that even. But it's not the first time I face criticism for standing up for what I believe in. In my book, Getting Real, I write about standing up when people called me fat as a kid, when people called me stupid after winning Miss America, and a bimbo for working at Fox News. That kind of intolerance is no, di no doubt why politicians sometimes don't say what they really think because, well, the intolerance and, of course, re-elections. But could that now be changing? We now have Donald Trump advocating people on the terrorist watch list or the no-fly list to not be able to buy guns. Senator Rob Portman urging the same ban. Congressman Bob Dole, as you just heard, all Republicans. Maybe it's time for more of us to start getting real, to try to come together to actually get things done.